Factsverse presents What Fingerprints Say About Your Personality Dermatoglyphics is the scientific study of fingerprints. It's often used by forensic experts when solving crimes and missing person cases. For over 50 years, this science has been evolving. Since no two people share similar fingerprints, a person can be identified by those prints. Many people who study this science also believe that a person's fingerprint can say a lot about their personality. To understand what your fingerprints say, you need to take a look at them closely. And there are three basic types of fingerprints – loops, curves, and swirls. Which one do you have? What does it say about who you are? Keep listening and we'll let you know. Loops If your fingerprints are made of loops, it means that you have a broad personality type called sanguine. This means that you have a very calm and balanced personality. You're also a very kind person. If you have loop fingerprints, you often make friends very easily. You're warm, you're welcoming to just about everyone, even those who don't deserve your kindness get your kindness. People are often attracted to your personality because you're often very easily accessible and welcoming. There are some downsides to having this personality type, though. People with loop fingerprints are often so kind that they let people walk all over them. You also don't like work. It's not because you're a lazy person, it's because you need to always have your thoughts challenged. Unless you're working at a job where you have to use your mind all day, you'll probably get bored with your work very quickly. The Ulnar Loop The Ulnar Loop is a variation of the loop fingerprint. The fingerprint will actually look like a waterfall that flows toward the pinky finger and it has triangular points. If you have this type of fingerprint, you're a person who is addicted to schedules. You need to know where you should be and what you should be doing at all times of the day. You have excellent observation skills, too, and you might even find a line of work where you can use those abilities. The main thing that defines you is that you live in the moment. You're spontaneous, but not to a fault. Most people find your spontaneity charming. The Radial Loop Another loop variation is the Radial Loop. This one flows toward the thumb. This fingerprint means that you are very independent and quite witty. You are usually the person who doesn't go with the flow. You'd rather question things to be sure that you're making the right decisions, even if people don't like you doing so. You also have a thirst for knowledge. Curves or Arches If you have arches or curved fingerprints, you likely have a broader personality called choleric. People with this fingerprint pattern are often confident and energetic. People with this fingerprint pattern are often stubborn, too. You'll stick to your guns no matter what. And what makes this a great quality is that you are extremely loyal, almost to a fault. You would rather suffer than betray those who have confided in you. A Simple Arch A simple arch fingerprint is like the arch, but the lines are shaped a bit more like hills. If you have this fingerprint, you're likely an introvert. You're shy, but in time you can open up. You're also cautious, and you keep your feelings guarded. Your fears and worries are your own, and you choose to keep them to yourself. The Tented Arch This arch forms almost a triangle, just like a tent. This means that you have an extreme personality. You can be very open one second, then completely closed off the next. You're often unpredictable and very difficult to read. People rarely know what you're thinking, and they won't know until you are in one of your open moods. Finally, you're not afraid of challenges. Swirls or Whirls If you have swirls on your fingerprints, you have a phlegmatic personality. You tend to be short-tempered and temperamental. You tend to be open-hearted, and you never hold a grudge. You're not the type to talk behind a person's back. You'd rather say it to them, even if it hurts their feelings. The best thing about this personality type is that you understand things pretty quickly, no matter how complex. Concentric Swirl This fingerprint has circles that expand and move to the center of the finger in from the edges. If you have this type of fingerprint, you tend to be self-centered, driven, and competitive. You hate when people try controlling you, and you tend to rebel against authority. Spiral Swirl If you have a spiral swirl pattern, it'll emerge from the center of your finger and then widen outward. If you have this fingerprint, you likely have goals. You are self-motivated, and you work hard to reach those goals. You're not the type of person to seek out advice, either. You'd rather figure things out for yourself. Press Swirl 
This pattern is slightly elongated, with swirls in the center of your finger. If you have this fingerprint, your ambitions are your weaknesses. You're not one to deal with mediocrity. You try to excel and you expect those around you to do the same. You're always pushing yourself and those around you to excel. Imploding Swirl This pattern resembles the Tai Chi design. If you have this fingerprint, you are great at multitasking. You're able to concentrate and you can manage a number of things with no problem. You're a friendly person and very sympathetic and you show empathy to everyone. Peacock's Eye This fingerprint resembles a peacock's eye, which is where it gets the name. If you have this fingerprint, you are creative. You also communicate well and you understand people. If you have this fingerprint, you'd be a great writer, painter, or musician. Variant Patterns Variant patterns really have no true form. It's a blend of all the fingerprints combined. If you have that pattern, you are a leader. Some people might mistake this for arrogance. When it comes to your choices, you expect everyone to support you, even if you are wrong. What fingerprint type do you have? And did we describe your personality right? Let us know in the comments below and subscribe for more!